What's up guys? Finally, it's been such a long time. I finally have elk hunting videos to share with you. This is the first one, day one, episode one of my Idaho archery elk hunt. This is an over-the-counter tag, tough unit, lots of people, not a ton of elk, but I've seen success in it before, so I decided to give it a try. This is day one. The season opened the last day of August, I believe. It'll go into more details in the actual video, but I wanted to let you know that you can look forward to seeing the rest of the elk videos probably later this weekend or the next coming week. So, so episode two might go live tomorrow, might go live Saturday, Sunday, or Monday, but then there will go from there. I'm thinking there's going to be at least 12 episodes, maybe more, maybe less, but stay tuned for that. After that, I also have more fishing and deer hunting videos that'll be coming up, my whitetail hunt from New Jersey, but I wanted to go ahead and let you see these elk hunting videos first. It was super fun hunt. You'll get to see how it plays out and uh, let me know what you think. Hope you guys are having good luck out there on your own hunts. I said I was gonna get your pillow and I was being nice. Mm -hmm. And then I forgot. Very girlfriend. You really think so? Well, I just thought you went in to get it. Did you just, just change your mind? I must have grabbed something else. It's alright. I'll survive, baby. You mad? No, I love my pillow, but we'll survive. I've had pillows before. Well, we set up camp. The trailer has a good spot, and we took the four wheeler right to check a camera. Got moo cows right away. Moo cows right away. Not what we're after. There's, yeah, definitely going to be a lot of moo cows on this. Two thousand, over two thousand photos on the stealth cam in around a month and a half, and it still had ninety-one percent battery. Pretty yeah. cool. What do you think, trailer cat? What do you think? You doing work? Always. You have a hot spot? Only I would find a fly in my cooking pot. What if I ate that? <laughs> Yum. Steak fajita soup. down and then I realize it's not mine it's somebody else's <sighs> Eric might know whose it is document every trail game <laughs> I've located we're going to where I said the blind last week it's a long hot hike but we're almost to my camera look it just won't focus well, we check the camera and there's like two, what? Two cows on it ever. Um, since I put the blind up like a week ago. So we took the blind down because we have opportunity to put it maybe somewhere else on a watering hole or something. Because based on the cameras down low, the elk have definitely moved low. 
so Eric and I are getting out of here. We've seen probably 30 deer, two stud bucks, but. But nothing we can make a move on, as of today at least. But we're getting down. And we still have some time to maybe chase them out this evening if we can find some. So hopefully we can. Thanks to all your comments on Instagram and the YouTube video, I was able to fold the blind down myself. Yeah. <laughs> I folded it up. She's like, oh, did you do that? <laughs> Well, funny story, I posted that, that I couldn't close the blind both on Instagram and YouTube. And on Instagram, I got like probably 20 DMs of people saying, dude, one day it took me two hours <laughs> to try and close it. And other people were like, you should see the wrestling matches I've had. <laughs> with those blinds and it just made me laugh so hard because that was totally me like I was popping everything open and closed twisting it around I was on the inside of it the outside trying to make it work and I never could but Eric's got some secret knowledge that I don't got he, he could just close it down the worst ones are like the circular ones that are kind of like your windshield that like fold into a circle I've people, see people twist down and bend down and it's just like that sweet spot where you're like whoa what just happened I have I have one of those and it is fully open <laughs> never been closed because I can't figure it out <laughs> true story so sad news we went to go check one of the one of my trail cameras that was sitting on water just north of here and it's gone um, it was in a lock box and uh, locked and everything with like a wire lock and it's totally gone people are so disrespectful like just spend a hundred bucks and get your own trail camera you know there's always the people that say like oh you put it on public land that's the risk you take i disagree i think people should have respect for each other's stuff and uh i would never touch anyone else's stuff whether it was on public land or whatever it doesn't matter so it always blows my mind that people like that are out there I haven't had one stolen in Utah. I've had SD cards stolen and stuff like that, but um, I did have one stolen in New Jersey on my property, but this is my first one stolen out west of the in Idaho. It's a cool Idaho. We're looking for a uh, look right now, but no luck yet. It's been tough. No elk spotted at all today, but we're making some bomb dinner. Eric's on the potato duty. Potatoes and onions. Potatoes and onions. The best. The best, huh? And I have water boiling inside the trailer on my camp chef for some rice and beans. And then we're making um, teriyaki marinated salmon. So that's gonna be pretty darn good. I'm pretty excited. I'm really hungry. Are you hungry, Eric? I'm starving. This is why I wanted to come back to dinner. Really? Are you hungry, Brookie? Brookie. But there you are. You watching, Eric? Did you have a good day in the trailer, Brooke? Did you just watch the window and sleep all day? Well, that's cooking. Check out camp. Cute trailer. Got my truck. There's her butt, there's us with her elk. We're all eating and drinking. I'm getting full. How are you doing up there? I'm actually getting full too, but I had a huge plate. Look at the size of that. 
<laughs> it's so good though. Brookie dehydrates herself all day and then drinks her whole water bottle. I don't understand. She'll drink it bone dry. In one sitting? Yeah. Well, that's a wrap. Dinner was great. Look how cute all the lights are in my trailer. We're going to bed and we're hunting in the morning. So I'll see you guys then and let you know how it goes. Hopefully we see some elk.